our home galaxy, the Milky Way, continues to reveal its secrets as advanced telescopes peer deeper into its mysterious heart. Two groundbreaking discoveries have recently transformed our understanding of our cosmic neighborhood. Using the Atacama Large Millimeter Josh Submillimeter Array, ALMA, astronomers have identified swirling space tornadoes near the supermassive black hole at our galaxy's core. Meanwhile, another team using the Green Bank Telescope has uncovered a massive, previously unknown molecular cloud in the Milky Way's bar region. These findings offer fresh insights into the dynamic processes shaping our galaxy, from violent activity in the central molecular zone, CMZ, to the vast gas reservoirs fueling star formation. In this video, we will explore these remarkable discoveries and their significance for our cosmic environment. The Milky Way Center has long been known as a turbulent environment dominated by gravitational forces from its supermassive black hole, Sagittarius A star. Now, an international team led by Kai Yang of Shanghai Jiao Tong University has discovered enigmatic filamentary structures they describe as space tornadoes. These slender filaments were detected in the CMZ using ALMA's high resolution capabilities allowing astronomers to observe structures at a 0.01 parsec scale, 100 times finer than previous observations. The filaments, composed of silicon monoxide and other molecules, act as tracers of shock waves, suggesting they result from intense turbulence rather than conventional star formation processes. Unlike previously known galactic filaments, these structures display coherent motion, lack any association with dust emission, and appear to dissipate rapidly. Xing Lu of the Shanghai Astronomical Observatory compared them to tornadoes, describing them as violent gas streams that efficiently distribute material into their surroundings. The discovery challenges existing models of gas flow in the galactic center and introduces a new category of transient structures that influence interstellar chemistry and material circulation. Scientists believe these filaments are formed through interaction between strong magnetic fields and shock waves. The immense gravitational forces near Sagittarius A Pre star create powerful turbulence, sending shock waves rippling through the central molecular zone. These shocks compress and accelerate gas, aligning it along magnetic field lines, which could explain the coherent motion of the filaments. This process is reminiscent of how solar prominences form on the Sun, but on an entirely different scale, spanning thousands of astronomical units. The presence of these filaments also offers a new perspective on how matter is redistributed near the galactic core. In addition to fueling star formation, they may play a role in feeding the black hole itself, regulating the rate at which it accretes material. This could provide valuable clues to understanding active galactic nuclei in distant galaxies, where similar processes might be occurring on a much grander scale. The identification of space tornadoes sheds light on a hidden material circulation cycle at the Milky Way's core. These slim filaments act as intermediaries in a complex process driven by shock waves, which strip molecules from dust grains, injecting them into the interstellar medium. The rapid dissipation of these filaments ensures continuous replenishment of shock processed material, maintaining a dynamic balance between depletion and redistribution. Silicon monoxide plays a crucial role in this process, as it exclusively traces shock regions with high density and temperature. By observing silicon monoxide's rotational transitions, astronomers can pinpoint active shock sites and study how extreme conditions shape molecular evolution. The presence of methanol acetonitrile and cyanoacetylene in these filaments suggests that this cycle contributes to the formation of complex organic molecules, deepening our understanding of interstellar chemistry. Moreover, this process could be linked to the formation of protoplanetary environments. As material circulates through the CMZ, some of it may eventually settle into stable regions where planets and stars form. This suggests that the extreme conditions of the galactic center 
while hostile, may also foster the building blocks of planetary systems. The discovery also has broader implications for galactic evolution. If similar filaments exist throughout the CMZ, they could play a fundamental role in regulating the Milky Way's central environment. Future ALMA surveys may confirm whether these tornado-like structures are a widespread phenomenon influencing the redistribution of mass and energy at the galactic core. While astronomers unraveled mysteries at the galactic center, another team led by Natalie O. Butterfield of the National Radio Astronomy Observatory uncovered a colossal molecular cloud, M4.7-0.8, in the Milky Way's Bar region. Detected via the Green Bank Telescope, this previously unknown cloud is a significant addition to the catalog of star-forming reservoirs. This giant molecular cloud spans 195 light years in longitude and 65 light years in latitude, with a mass exceeding 160,000 solar masses. It resides in a dust lane along the Milky Way's bar, a structure funneling material toward the galactic center. These lanes serve as cosmic highways, transporting gas that fuels star formation in the galaxy's inner regions. Within this cloud, Astronomers identified substructures like the nexus, the brightest CO emission region, and the filament, a thread-like extension suggestive of future stellar nurseries. Two dense regions, not B and not E, may be active star-forming sites, while a shell-like structure hints at stellar feedback shaping the cloud's evolution. The cloud's temperature, around 20 Kelvin, is optimal for star formation, indicating that it could become a significant birthplace of new stars in the coming millions of years. Additionally, the study of M4.7-0.8 provides a new perspective on galactic bar dynamics. Scientists theorize that the motion of gas through these bars helps regulate star formation across different galactic regions. By tracking the movement and composition of M4.7-0.8, Astronomers hope to determine how efficiently material moves from the outer disk toward the inner star-forming rings of the Milky Way. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more cosmic discoveries.